Yo, I'm gonna try to do this shit, man. My internet connection is still fucked up. I think it's my phone. I'm gonna try to finesse it, man. In the building, man. Appreciate everybody that's tuning in. I'm trying to invite motherfuckers to come in right quick. My shit gonna be going in and out. I'm gonna try to make it work. Uh, so, yeah, man, I titled this shit right quick. Um, you know, first off, happy Father's Day to those that they kids taking care of their kids and shit. Just salute these niggas out here, man. I know I got a son of my own, man. So, you know, <clears throat> hope he's in nap town, you know what I mean? Celebrating some shit today. Uh, shit, hold on. Try to invite some people up in here. Give me a second here. Oh, yeah, you already know, Kevin. You already know. Stucky. You already know, man. You already know, Stucky. That's my dude right there. All right, try to make this happen, make this work a little bit. Uh, I'm look a little. <coughs> it is what it is. You heard. Uh, <laughs> See if I can get a few more people. See if I can invite some people right quick. Appreciate those that are tuning in with me right now. Just give me a second. Just give me a second, people. My connection may go in and out, but bear with me, brother. You understand? Inviting people. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, bear with me. Appreciate those that's coming in and checking me out right now. All right, hold on. Just do a couple more. Now my connection coming in and out, so you got to bear with me. I'm trying to invite people at the same time. You know how it be. Oh, you know, say what's up to my dogs. Dogs is crazy. Um... Yeah, man, happy Father's Day to those that, uh, you know, celebrate, man. I hope it's a good, beautiful day where you at. Uh, you know, I try to check in with my home city, Naptown. I, I rep Naptown all day, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, you yeah, you taught me how to fight people. Yeah, you did. You did, Carol. That's what's up. And I appreciate that because now every time I get on, I'm trying to, I'm trying to invite people, invite people, invite people, you know, you know what I mean? So, you know what I mean? Uh, just like I said, bear with me a little bit. I got stuff coming in and out. Oh, shit. All right, so let's get this popping a little bit. So, um, like I said, man, happy Father's Day again. You know what I mean? Can't say it enough. Everybody celebrate. Um, you know what I'm saying? Father's Day sometimes gets unnoticed like it should not be. You know what I'm saying? So if you're a father out here and you are really a real father, you know what I mean? I hope you're able to have some type of peace today. Hey! Hope you have some type of peace today. You know what I mean? Um, atmosphere, the ambiance. You understand? But, um, yeah, man, I want to address a couple of things, man. Uh, you know, I was looking on Facebook earlier. You know, there's like a uh, in my home, there's a ceasefire. Uh, some some OGs, you know, what I'm saying, looking like they organizing something in the hood today, off Hillside, I believe. I think they're having like a barbecue, cook, <clears throat> water fight. You know what I mean? But I think they're doing it from like 12 to 5 nap time. You know what I mean? Uh, 
think they're doing some uh, candlelight, candle vigil later on tonight, night, you know, for those that have failed uh, to violence, you know what I mean, gunfire and shit. So if you in the city, man, check that out off a of hillside. You understand what I'm saying? Um, not too sure it was all organized and if I saw it, I shared it. You know what I mean? But, um, uh, yeah, man, you know what I mean? What, 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 another thing that's hitting the, the airwaves on, on the social media, this T.I. situation. <laughs> so apparently T.I. was in Nap, or not Nap, but I think he was in Indi Indiana somewhere, maybe Fort Wayne, maybe, uh, doing a concert. And they got him backstage. And backstage, and I think another female comes over. Now, people were saying the female was an actress uh, or might have had something to do with the restaurant Houston's or whatever. I know it was a big deal that happened down there in Atlanta with the restaurant Houston's or whatever. So they got him, you know, showing him, slapping her on her ass and hugging up on her or whatever. I see some women out here like, fuck T.I., hope, hope that nigga died. He ain't never coming back and blah, blah, blah. Like, yeah, man, y'all got to understand, man, T.I. and Tiny. I believe they have an open relationship or an open marriage. You understand? What I'm because, I mean, Tiny has been linked to Floyd Mayweather. You understand what I'm saying? So people need to pump their brakes when they start seeing things like that because you don't know what the situation is. You know what I'm now, my problem is, first of all, let me shout out to everybody that's watching. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Stucky, I gave a shout out to him. Is it East? East? I don't want to mispronounce your name, sister. Is it Easter? Easter? I C C I R occur. Uh, <coughs> I don't know. My homeboy Laron, you know what I'm saying? I want to holler at you too, bro, man. Trying to get up on your uh your show sometime. You know what I mean? We can cross promote politics, something, man. I, I fuck with you heavy, bro. Uh, Anthony Neal. Uh, is it Talia? Talia? Norman Jones. Kara, what up? Nicole Carter, Kara, what up? Andrea, nah, bullshit, what up, Andrea? Um, Tracy, is it Daria? N Nashika? N nah, Nashika? Nash Nashika? His Ms. Nicole? Jason Clark, what up, homeboy? Um, Kishmael? Uh, but yeah, man, just to address that situation, look, man, my problem, my problem with the recording shit, which I'm not fast, my pro problem with the, with the recording of that TI situation was that, man, one of the biggest problems we got out here, not in just Indiana, but just overall period. When you look at these videos on Facebook or social media or whatever it is, hey boy, hey, King. Y'all can see my dogs, man. They in the building. Uh, my problem is, is that, man, you got these grown, I don't even know if they men, you got these grown males out here. <clears throat> Just about every recording I've seen, whether it be fights, situations, you can just scroll down shit. You got dudes out here recording this shit, like a fight. Motherfuckers ain't looking to call the police. They ain't looking to try to go help. It could be a woman getting her ass beat. And a dude is sitting there like, oh shit, world star. World star needs a world star. That's my problem, man. What's up with these niggas out here recording? Recording shit, man. What's up with that, man? It's like a lot of moist ass niggas out here, man. I'm talking about extra moist. You know what I'm saying? And then when you see the footage of this shit, uh, the niggas like backstage at this T.I. concert. All right, stop. Stop. There's Charlie right here, man. Wild as shit. He's only four months old, man. Look at him. He's only four months, man. The dude's only four months old, man. Terrible. But, uh, you know what I mean? The dude, the dude who's recording this, and he's like behind. Oh shit! He's behind stage. He's behind the stage, and you can see him move the curtain back. 
and he's recording and he's like, that ain't, that ain't tiny. That ain't tiny. Who is that? On some gossipy moist shit. Like, niggas, we got to stop that shit, man. We got to stop that, man. All right. Stop chewing on that. We got to stop that shit. We got to stop recording. We got to stop recording that, man. I can understand. You know what I mean? That's that's something that, that, that I can see women doing that. You know what I mean? Recording. You know what I mean? Because, you know, that you know <clears throat> it's in a woman's nature to, to be on some gossipy shit like that. But these dudes, you niggas got to stop. Grown ass men out here recording shit and don't even know the situation, but but want want to try to do that to try to get some type of attention. You know what I'm saying? Please, man, please. If you see a nigga recording something like that, man, slap that phone out that nigga hand, man, please. Let that nigga know. Stop. Stop with the moisture out here, people. All right. It's out of hand, man. You know, you got people in, in, in Indiana like, hey, man, fuck the yard, fuck the yard, which I doubt he will. But, but if he do come back, that ain't going to stop people from coming to see his concert. You understand what I'm saying? Like I said, you don't know what the situation he got with Tiny. But it looks like they got, it looks like they got an open marriage. You understand what I'm saying? So, you know, just, just when, <laughs> and, and it's funny, man, because it's like, man, it, it, the nigga really moved the curtain back. The nigga was like recording and shit. <laughs> like why, man? Can somebody explain to me why? Appreciate those coming. Those with Sarah, Greg. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Appreciate yeah. those coming in. You know what I'm saying? But that has to stop, man. That shit has to stop. You know what I'm saying? Niggas out here recording all. I guarantee you, all through your timeline, any videos of ratchet shit or hood shit or whatever, it's always a nigga recording, man. Like, stop, man. That shit is corny, B. Shit, shit is extra, extra corny. You know what I'm saying? Uh, like I said, shout out to all the fathers out here. You know, I see some people on the timeline, you know, women like, I'm a father too. I don't have my father. My baby daddy around, fuck that nigga. Look, man. If today's a day that even if you're the father, even some of these women chose for these men not to be around, let these kids try to find out who their father is, man. You know what I'm saying? Especially the young girls out here. It's very important. You understand what I'm saying? I'm no I'm jumping all over a little bit. But you know what I'm saying? Let this day be a good day. You know, the whole weekend, you understand what I'm saying? Let this be a a day that starts, you know, something that could possibly reconnect kids with their fathers because it's very important for a father to be in a child's life. So, you know what I mean? I wanted to just do this video right quick, man. Appreciate those, everybody checking shit out. You know what I mean? I hope y'all stay cool. You know what I mean? It's like damn near, it's damn near like 100 degrees out here. But that's that's normal out here in Texas, you know what I mean? But, um, you know what I mean? Out my home city, I heard it's like 100 degrees. Stay cool, you understand? And uh, like I said, there's a ceasefire uh, barbecue event going on off a of hillside, I believe, in, in Indianapolis. You know, check that out. I believe they're doing it from like 12 to 5. And uh, they're having a... Um, candle visual later on the night you know for those kids uh, have fallen to gun violence you know i saw the story out there about a 14 year old kid that got shot at a party and um you know that's why today is today's like this is an important day you know i was talking with i was actually talking to my mother and we were talking about the situation uh that happened out there with the little, little 14 year old boy that got shot um, I think it was two other kids that got shot. And I think it was like a 13-year-old. I believe that they got turned away from the party. And I came, and they came back and started shooting the place up. And I guarantee, I guarantee, there were probably no men around that situation. There was probably no men around. You know what I mean? We got to start being protectors of our kids out here, man. You know what I'm saying? We got to start policing our neighborhoods better. You understand what I'm saying?
there should have been at least some men out there out front of the place. You understand what I'm saying? There should have been at least some men around the area. You know what I mean? I can't do this by them. The women can't do this shit by themselves. You understand what I'm saying? Men gotta gotta step it up. You know what I mean? The OGs, any OGs that's really left out there. Social media fucks this shit up. You understand what I'm saying? Social media got OGs out here wanting to live their second childhood and you know what I mean? Uh be more like be like a, a teenager when you in when you a grown man, you know what I mean? Stop trying to be like a fucking teenager and be a grown man out here. You understand what I'm saying? It's, it's a sad situation that happened out there in my city, my home city. But you know what I mean? We just got to organize better, man. We got to get our economic game together. You understand what I'm saying? Police ourselves better. You know what I mean? Especially in my home city. Fuck that 10-point coalition co-op uh, uh, COINTEL program bullshit. Fuck all that 10-point coalition shit. They ain't about to help with nothing. You understand what I'm saying? So, you know, just wanted to connect with the people right quick. Like I said, man, shout out to uh, La Monica. Shout out to um, to Sean, uh, everybody that's watching this right here. You know what I mean? Drop a comment, hit the, <clears throat> hit the like button on this shit, share it. You know what I mean? Make it do what it do. But I want to address those things. You know what I mean? Um, you know, according to, according to what people are saying, Ti ain't never. It, I don't blame Ti. You understand know what I'm saying? I don't blame none of, none of these artists that act like they don't want to come back to Indiana or Indianapolis. Because Indianapolis is a is a hater city. Let's just be honest. Or Indiana is a hater capital. It, it's somewhat to a degree is. You know what I'm saying? So we gotta do better, man. Stop recording shit. Stop being on some moist ass nigga shit. And stop stop being on this on this female feminine shit. You understand what I'm saying? Now I, I share something on my Last night I shared something on my page, which was very deep, and in it in in coincides with what's, what's going on this Father Day weekend. You got, um, I believe the company is called Art, Art Artica or Art Arta Arta something, but it's a chemical. It's a chemical uh, company that sprays chemicals on the uh, vegetable that they sell out here. All right, and I don't know how long ago. This video was, uh, what up, Carol? What up? Hey. But I don't know uh, how long ago this video really surfaced, but it's a scientist out there in, uh, it's a scientist out there in California. What up, Pebbles? What up, girl? Um, it's a scientist out there in California but exposed this company that, um, they, they drop, they drop this uh, chemical in the water for drinking water and they spray chemicals on, on the vegetables that are being sold to be eaten and consumed um, yeah yeah please yeah we gotta start growing our own food you understand what I'm saying but the reason why I bring this up because the chemicals that they spray on these food and chemicals they put in this water is turning men and males ultimately gay the chemicals are so bad that is it's turning fe uh, males into f females you know what I mean uh, the scientist was saying that um, when this chemicals di digested into your system it can make you grow eggs like a female it can uh, uh, damn near produce in your body extra estrogen you know what I mean so this whole homosexual thing, you know what I mean, is deeper than just being gay. You understand what I'm saying? I really believe that they're really trying to turn people into being gay. You know what I'm saying? So all these male just were saying that, you know, this this chemical is is making boys and men not even have a fully developed penis. You know what I'm saying? We gotta be careful out here. Like Carol said, we gotta grow our own food. And it's and it's hard out here, you know what I mean? Like spraying corn, they spraying all these vegetables with this with this pesticide uh shit. It's fucking your body up. 
So we got to be careful on what we putting in our bodies, man. You know what I'm saying? Along with the meat. You know what I'm saying? This meat is killing us out here. You understand what I'm saying? If you if you eating meat, now I don't know, it's different in Indiana. Down here in Texas, um, you know, they, they, they farm raise a lot of meat. You know what I mean? They keep their meat production local. They keep their meat production local down here in Texas. You understand what I'm saying? Now in Indiana, I know they got they got farms in Indiana. Um Yeah, Carol, yo. Our children are given, yo, I believe that they're giving our children more of the other hormones to make us docile and confused. Yeah. We in a silent war out here. You know what I'm saying? Women out here, women out here on this Father Day weekend, please, if you go somewhere, man, try to go somewhere with a male, a male friend, you know what I mean? Black women out here are not safe out here in these streets um, by themselves. Yeah, vaccines. Yeah, the vaccines is, is, is turning people, um, you know what I mean? But black women out here, man, I see black women, y'all y'all getting attacked out here. See, what they're doing is um, you, you, you go to these Chinese spots, you see a lot of Chinese people attacking black women, you know what I mean? Because uh, that's what they're doing. You know, they attack the black women. Um, and then what they do with the men, they let the police kill us. You understand what I'm saying? Like I said, it's a silent war going on right now. You know what I mean? They're trying to exterminate black people because they know that 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 a lot of a lot of white supremacists or white extremists know that their days are numbered. You know what I mean? They're dying off more than they're making babies. You understand what I'm saying? So they're trying to do what they can do to get rid of the black fathers out here. But we got to be careful, man. Like I say, black women, do not travel anywhere alone. Please make sure you you have a black man with you. It doesn't matter <coughs> who it is. You know what I mean? If it's a male friend, you know what I mean? A lot of y'all, a lot of y'all have male friends and shit. Creating a subliminal culture of fear. Don't get me. It's get it started get it popping get it cracking out here you know what i'm saying because we gotta we gotta be in tune with this shit out here you know what i mean um anything that they say is wrong when it comes out here what they saying is wrong that shit's probably right anything that they hold up to a higher standard is probably some bullshit so watch this shit out here you understand so i just wanted to touch bases with the people you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I appreciate everybody that's came in and watched me. Uh, is it Tierra? Uh, is it Ar Archibald? That's a hard-ass name. Archibald Kim Jr. That's what's up. But pay attention out here. Be cautious out here. You know what I mean? A plan A plan is definitely coming. I know a brother like me, man. I'm trying to play my part. You know, I'm trying to get my shit in order. And trust me, when it comes back, it's going to come back heavy. You know what I'm saying? So <clears throat> pay attention out here, please. <clears throat> also, please do not let your kids out here by themselves. You know what I'm saying? Black kids are getting snatched up. You know what I mean? It was a couple reports up in Chicago. A couple black girls got killed. You know what I'm saying? They harvesting our, 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 our organs. You know what I'm saying? Because they know that the melanin that we carry can cure diseases. You know what I mean? They know that the melanin we got in our bodies they can use our cells, cures of cancer and shit like that. So be cautious out here with your kids, man. Don't let your kids just go out here by themselves. You know what I mean? Because these kids are getting snatched up out here. You understand? So please. Yeah. I know. yeah. She just tore up my wood. Yeah, I know. What you gonna do about that? Oh, you still alive? Yeah. My bad. <laughs> Back up. As you see, regulation is starting to take place. <laughs> yeah, we are superhuman. Don't sleep. Yeah, for real. Don't sleep at all. Charlie. Punk ass nigga. So, yeah, I ain't about to be on here too much longer, man. I just wanted to connect to the people right quick. Be cautious out here. You know what I mean? Like I say, uh, just be cautious, man. You know what I mean? We out here. We out here. On, we out here at war. 
You know what I'm saying? And, and niggas out here talking about you don't want to get nobody scared, make nobody mad out here. That's some weak ass, whole ass nigga shit. You understand what I'm saying? If you ain't if you ain't willing to die and put your life on the line for something, then you'll fall for anything. You know what I'm saying? Read books to your kids. Let your kids read to you. We got too many dumbass kids out here because we got too many dumbass parents. You understand what I'm saying? Get this shit right out here. You know what I mean? Let's get this shit popping. You know what I mean? We turning up too much. Let's try to turn the shit down. Actually organize. You know, shouts out to the black women out in my home. You know what I mean? That are business women. You know what I mean? That have their own businesses and shit. You know, shouts out to the men too that got their own business. But let's get this shit right. You know what I mean? So uh appreciate everybody you know what i mean it's your boy jay scott man tuning in hope y'all enjoy your day i'm out of here though man peace